surge of copper thefts in Pasadena. City officials say thieves are targeting copper wire from streetlights. Dozens of cases have been reported over the last three months. And that's resulting in thousands of dollars in damage there. NBC4's Anastasia Olmos live right now in Pasadena with more on where this is happening, what's being done to keep the lights on. Anastasia? Well, good evening, guys. You know, police have been responding to these copper thefts all over the city, but many happening to street lights along Allen Street right behind me. Now, they say that these thieves are opening the electrical box on the floor. They're cutting the wire. They're pulling several hundreds of feet of this copper out, and then they're turning around and selling it. We got here in the morning and we saw that it was the whole thing was taken off and the wires were cut. Sonia Seda Lopez arrived to work on January 6th to find thieves had tried to steal the copper wire in the light pole in front of her family's AC business on Corson Street in Pasadena. Right now with daylight saving, it gets dark pretty quickly. Yeah, so it's scary to not have light and not feel safe. Luckily, she says Pasadena Public Works restored the light the next day. But according to city documents, this was one of five of these thefts in the city that night. Thieves are stealing hundreds to thousands of dollars worth of copper wire from streetlights. They're accessing the underground wire through pull boxes, cutting it from one end to another. These copper thefts have been happening all over L.A. County. The city says as thieves attempt to sell the copper to recycling centers for cash. Right now, copper can sell for more than $3 a pound. We were speechless. We couldn't believe how someone came and vandalized right in front of our property. So, yeah, it was scary. Seda Lopez said they also had a man hop the fence recently and take copper from their AC equipment. They caught him on their surveillance cameras and called police. The man took off with nothing. It could be the same people. I don't know what's going on here, but it's definitely a safety issue for us. In the last three months, police say there have been 34 incidents of copper thefts totaling five miles worth of wire and 280 city lights damaged. When the city came back, they were able to uh, cement it down to make sure that this, is, this doesn't happen again. Police have made a few arrests, but a spokesperson for the city tells me that they believe that some of these thieves may be part of organized crime rings bigger than the city here and bigger than L.A. County. The L.A. County supervisors, as well as the city, they're offering about 20 grand in rewards up to for any information leading to arrest. Reporting in Pasadena, Anastasia Olmos, NBC4 News.